Hello, welcome to my channel. If this is your first time here, my name is Quishan. On this channel, I like to do makeup and mukbangs. Today is a makeup day. I created this very easy fall look using the Be Myself and Mitchell palette. So if you want to see how I got this look and get ready with me, please keep watching. All right, guys. So I'm going to do... I want to do something pretty simple today but you know cute i want to do an ombre type fall situation and again i'm using the me myself and mitchell palette it just has all the colors that i need oh my gosh let me get my makeup wipes i need them right next to me they were right next to me okay so I'm using the Me, Myself, and Mitchell palette. This palette just has all the colors that I need to create, you know, honestly, any kind of look, but specifically the fall look that I want to do today. I think I'm going to stick to three colors again today. Look at this palette, y'all. I mean, yeesh. So I'm going to use a little bit from each side. I want to do a yellow, orange, brown ombre situation with a smoky wing. I just watched a video with Ann Nook earlier, and she did a look like this, similar to what I'm about to do. So how y'all doing y'all all right i'm cool y'all recording a few videos on this good what is today all right so primer my eyes with the p louise eyeshadow base i do all my black friday shopping online <laughs> i don't have time to be in a crowded behind um store getting pushed around and knocked around starting up with this shade mixer right here I don't like shopping in the store anyway. Let me zoom in a little bit so y'all can get in my eye. Hold please. I'm probably gonna end up using the exact same shades I used in my last video, my last makeup video. These are just like really good fall shades. And they match a shirt I'm about to put on a little bit, so. Um, but anyway, Black Friday, yeah. Um, I'll be shopping from the comfort of my own home. People like to act a fool. And I'm not buying much. I just need like, um, I definitely want to get an air fryer. Some room decorations. I want to decorate my room in the corner in the space where I mukbang. I want a little bit more going on in the background instead of just a plain background. So I'm going to get some stuff to decorate that. Um, I d actually don't know if I'm buying any makeup. Can you believe it? And smooth out those edges. So I hope y'all had a wonderful Thanksgiving. Mine was great. How long do y'all eat off of y'all um, Thanksgiving leftovers? I do it for like two days and then I'm done. That's enough. All right, next up I'm taking the shade Main right here. I love a simple ombre look like this and honestly you know i've done this with other colors before and of course you can you know but we keep in this fall themed all right y'all there is so much beauty community drama going on listen i'm not really like you know i i try not to read too much of the drama i'm lying i love reading the beauty community drama but listen some people getting called out though and in my opinion, rightfully so. I ain't gonna say no names though, cause I ain't, I ain't in it, you know? So I'm just gonna start blending this in. Just very wiggling my brush in between these two shades so that they mix together nicely. Sorry if you hear like machinery noise. Mike is working in the garage and his tools are very loud. It's always something making noise in my video, whether it be the birds, the neighbors, Mike. They don't want me to be great. Yeah, I don't know what I be talking about sometimes. I really don't. I definitely need to put something above my bra bone. I don't like when my bra bone is like bare, especially doing a look like this. But I'm trying to decide, do I want to put shimmer there or do I want to just put a matte shade, which I probably just do a matte shade because I'm, I'm feeling the matte eye lately. All right, so next up, I'm taking the shade Monday right here. And I'm just gonna put that on the outside. It's pretty much the same shades I used last time, except for I used Man Made last time instead of this main shade. I definitely need to blend these out more. They look like too separate. They don't look ombre enough. 
So no wing today. I'm just gonna take my Fenty Beauty fly liner and just draw a line straight across. And this line doesn't have to be perfect because I am gonna smudge it out. Focus on me. So now I'm gonna take this black shade Mafia right here and I'm gonna use that to smudge out my eye line. I'm kind of going to take this into that dark brown, but not too much, just a little bit up into it. You know, I'm sorry, I don't have much to talk about today. I think because I'm so hungry, I'm just thinking about food. So I'm going to put some glue on my lashes, and the lashes that I'm using today are the ColourPop Lashes in the style Mommy. Mike is burning down the house. Call the police. Listen, I'm in the middle of filming, so I can't tend to the emergency. <laughs> I love that the smoke alarm is just going off and I'm just like sitting here like very casually like, I gotta get these lashes on oh, girl. I think that something's wrong with the battery y'all. He just threw it. <sighs> I'm gonna like break a sweat in here. I'm sorry that I always talk about how hot it is in here, but it's so weird because I just had on the heater. I was so cold before I started filming. Y'all think he burning something for real? I smell something. Hold on, I'll be back. I will be back. I get so confused sometimes about like which lash goes on which eye. These bitches be looking the same. Y'all, it's 3.30 and I still have not eaten anything. Why do I do this to myself? So this is the HelloFab Pores Be Gone Matte Primer. Definitely grab too much primer. Cuckoo, coo, 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 coo. Primer feels so good. It's like a lot of matte primers that I use are hard to like spread around and put on. This goes on super smooth and it just feels really good. And you can feel it. It just feels hydrating at the same time smoothing i'm just like really into this primer let me zoom out a pinch the foundation i'm using today is the maybelline fit me matte and poreless and i'm in the shade 355 coconut i hope i'm using this let's see she might be dead i really wish this had a pump a little bit of this foundation goes a very long way so i don't use too much of it this is one of my favorite og foundation it's super affordable. I think it's like $6. It's mattifying, but it's not like you don't look super dry or cakey. I mean, the shade is great. The shade range could be a little bit better, but I want to say Maybelline have made, I want to say Maybelline has um, expanded the shade range. Since I bought this, I've had it for a while. So don't get me on hairline, girl. <laughs> it's also um, pretty full coverage. I would say it's, med it's buildable full coverage. For concealer today, I'm using the Jouer Essential High Coverage Concealer in the shade Coffee. I haven't used this in a minute. So I'm using my Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder in Deep. As you can see, it tones down the concealer a lot, but still leaves me a little brightened underneath my eyes. And these work so well together, the concealer and the setting powder. They should get married. Now it's time to do my under eye detail. So I'm just gonna use the same shades I used up top. Just like this, the yellow, then the middle shade, and then the darkest, just like that. Just like that. Ooh, yes ma'am. So for eyeliner, I'm using the gel Marc Jacobs liner in the shade Earthquake. Ooh, hold on y'all, this thing is dry as hell. I gotta bend down and do this because I need to apply pressure. Whew, that was not easy. She needs some help. Y'all, I don't know if I wanna do a nude or like a dark brown lip. I might do a light brown nude. Do I do a glossy lip? Do I do a matte lip? Is it brown? Is it nude? What do I do? Okay, it's time to bronze. I'm going to use a different bronzer today. Just so I need to switch it up a little bit. <laughs> I'm using the Hoola Toasted Bronzer. You have to be very 
light with this because it is super pigmented. So I'm just using an extremely light hand. Uh-oh. <laughs> I've overbronzed. I mean, shout out to Benefit for making this thing so pigmented, but gay. Um, so I'm not gonna use this on my nose. It is too strong. So for my nose, I'm using the Fenty Beauty Coconati. Of course. I just, I can't even, I don't even wanna try it with the Hoola. I'm pretty sure I did already when I did the, when I first got it. Um, I did a video on it, reviewing it. It was just like, bruh, these birds. It was just too much for me to use on my nose. But I do like it for the rest of my face though. Cause I don't really like contour my nose. I just kind of bronze it up a little bit. So it's like barely even noticeable. But if I was to use that Hula one, you girl, you would see. She's snitching on me with what I know on my nose. Nice and subtle little Fenty Beauty moment. For blush, I'm using the Anastasia Blush Trio. And I think I want to use uh, this shade right here on the end, which is uh, Nectarine. I'm actually going to use this orangey shade too. Yeah, I'll go back and forth between the two of those, just like this. For highlighters, this is this such a warm look. I want to use the Marc Jacobs Guilty Highlighter. It's a beautiful, warm, golden highlighter. Y'all, I barely even tap my brush in this thing. I mean, look at this. I just wanted a little bit, a little piece. Put a little bit of this on my nose. For my inner eye, Okay, now that is setting it off. All right. I'm just gonna try this out. If I don't like it, I'm switching my lip color. So I'm lining my lips with BFF4 by ColourPop. Now I'm taking Cork by Dose of Colors. Oh yeah, y'all think this is it right here. Now, do I gloss it? Do I matte it? Do I mop? Do I gloss it? Do I matte it? Mm, I'm kind of feeling the matte look. What do y'all think? Yeah. And to set my face, I'm using the Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. Lock it in. All right, so let me take my hair down and I will be right back. So this is the finished look. What do you think? Do you like it? Am I cute? Y'all, thanks so much for getting ready with me. If you had a good time, if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. Share this video with everybody you know. Comment down below. Subscribe to my channel. Do all of those things. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video.